Hello cookbook friends! This is Carrie from Cookbook Divas and I had to go look up where Corsica was because I'm an uneducated American apparently and it is an island off of France that's owned by France since 1768 but their culture remains pretty Italian. So let's check it out. I've never looked through a Corsican cookbook and I can't wait to see what's going on. It is by Nicholas Stromboni. It came out I think in 2017. Ooh, starting off with a bang with some sea urchin food or something. Let's check out the table of contents. Number one, the pig in Corsica. Number two, meat and then cheese and then fruits of the sea and then fruits and vegetables, desserts, basics, and then Corsican wines. Okay, I love the design of this cookbook and it's driving my camera's white balance crazy. Whoa, starting off with lots of meat. Okay, Corsican charcuterie. Okay, portrait of a chef, of more about charcuterie. We're really starting off with the meat. Okay, aha, tomato, egg, and vuletta. Lentils and figatelli. I'm going to have to look up a lot of these terms. I don't, do you mean fi roast suckling pig? I'm guessing these are all pig dishes. Beans and sausage. Nice hearty cooking for winter. Pork terrine. Okay, I'm going to skip ahead to another chapter. Meat. Beautiful cookbook. Corsica's different meats. We're going to learn a lot from this book. Corsican veal. Here's a roast veal recipe. That looks really gross because I'm a vegetarian. Veal with olives. That definitely sounds Italian. Stuffed veal breast. Polpetti and salsa rasa. Does that have wine in it, I'm guessing? And then veal leg confit. Veal tartare. Lamb confit. Cheese. A whole cheese chapter. Corsican cheeses. How about, ooh, artichokes with braccio cheese. Yum. I've seen a lot of artichoke recipes today. Chestnut polenta. Never heard of such a thing. That sounds amazing. Imbruciati. Don't know what that is. Chaccia di Bruccio. I don't, I should have had a pronunciation guide. Whew. Gonna learn a lot from this. I see some dumpling type of thing. Fiadone. A great classic. Ooh, is that bread? It looks good. Mashed Bruccio cheese. You can mash up cheese and I will eat it. Omelette with that kind of cheese. Making a knife. Wow. Okay. Fruits of the sea. Wow. Lots of pictures of dead fish and things. Okay. Sea urchin, bread wine and sea urchin, sea bream tartare. Oh, that means raw, doesn't it? Bastia style anchovies. Scampi tartare. You know, there's no, definitely no Corsican restaurants anywhere on the West Coast that I know of. Correct me if I'm wrong. Scrambled eggs. They have something going on in there. Beautiful photography in here. Gambari in Aquavita. Is that shrimp or prawns? Marine salad. I don't know because I'm vegetarian. Okay, stuffed oysters, wild oysters, stone, stone cooked trout, cuttlefish. Looks nice and hearty. Let's get to the next chapter. Vegetables. Yay, Corsican herbs. Very big Corsican soup. <laughs> Tomato salad, stunning. Ratatouille, ooh, I would make that. Mertoli tart, that is gorgeous. I'm gonna give you a second to look at that. Whoa. Herb pie, not the greatest photo. Bonifacio style eggplants. Is that just eggplant marinara? Not sure. Tomato sauce recipe. Chiachia, looks like some kind of Torta, tortilla with cheese, mash. Now we're in the desserts chapter. It's going to be awesome. Oh, look at this beautiful section on Corsican citrus fruits. Wow. Let me know what you think of this cookbook in the comments below. I can't wait to hear. I've never seen a cookbook like this. Kuju jelly with white wine. I know I just massacred that term. Farinati. Looks like some kind of fried donuts. Yum. Not even going to try and pronounce this word. Okay, I am. Granagiola? Hmm, don't know. Castagnola. Citrus salad. Finucigetti. Hey, pretzels, sort of. Hmm. Tomato paste recipe, myrtle liqueur, the Corsican donkey, and info about wine. That was fascinating. I'm going to have to go look through this more slowly when you guys aren't around. 
slowing me down. Just kidding. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know what kind of cookbooks you would like me to seek out and look through for you on camera. Meanwhile, you can see our other cookbook look through videos on occasionally Pinterest, but usually YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook. We have a blog, cookbookdivas.com, with articles and news about cookbooks, sneak previews, and we have a podcast for those of you that like to listen. Thanks so much.